takes the knee high snap, straight drop back, time to throw this time, and now it's getting away! He's sacked! Yes. Touchdown! Who's Virginia! Touchdown. Who's? What a play by this Virginia defense! With Virginia winning the Coastal, and then Clemson moving on from the ACC championship game to the college football playoff, Virginia is the top team. And, uh, you know, obviously exciting for me as a, as a graduate in 1991 to be able to see this team make it to its first Orange Bowl while I'm on the committee. It's just very exciting. I had an opportunity to meet Coach Menon all the first year. He took over the program and he was kind enough to sit down with, with uh, me and, you know, asked me, hey, why did you come to the University of Virginia? And I told him my reasons, which were, hey, look, great academics, phenomenal uh, competition in, in regards to being part of the ACC and just a great all-around uh, student experience and he's like you know that's what I want to try to generate and he's done a phenomenal job I mean in such a short period of time to be able to go to multiple bowl games and every year really bring the program to another level and obviously to make it to you know our game uh, in the Orange Bowl a tier one game is, is a big deal and, a, and I'm really excited for the program and for all the all the UVA alums and, and fans to be able to come down and experience it. I think it's huge. I think again the coaching staff can point to this in recruiting and to be able to get new student athletes to come. I think you're, you're building a tradition. You know you're developing uh, even more interest from your fan base. We have a full week ahead um, for everybody to be able to enjoy from the players and the coaches to the, to the fans that come down to our game in South Florida. Being able to be on the beach and, and get great weather and for the fans to be able to enjoy as well our weather and a lot of the things that you can do outside to the coaches luncheon which will be on December 27th and the fan fest anyone has a ticket can come before the game at three o'clock and participate in our fan fest which is which is a lot of fun so I think I think it's going to be a, a lot of fun for everybody on on December 30th.